was really hungry. Mm, I am. Good morning, everyone. It's your London friend, Vasi, and today guys i'm sorry i cannot have the usual enthusiasm because quite frankly i'm very nervous about today's video because we're doing a one pound challenge in london which let's just say it's not really well known for how cheap it is so this video might go very wrong we might starve or from the other side if we find good offers it might also turn into the best day ever and the most budget friendly one and my strategy for the day is to get as much free food as possible and i'm talking about downloading any possible apps that give you free food or also using any coupons subscribing to newsletter giving all my data anything that gives me free food i'm going to do it and if you want to see more useful and fun content from london and also other places where we travel together don't forget to hit the subscribe bell button down below it's such a typical London day today it's just stopped raining and it is a little bit foggy but that's all right we're having some tap water since it's the only thing which we can afford at the moment but you guys it's like such a weird feeling that I have this fruit bowl in here and I cannot eat anything And after I panicked a little bit because I couldn't see where is my free donut, I finally claimed it and this is how it looks. It says, welcome donut, free original glazed one. I cannot wait to have breakfast because it's 10.30 and we're getting hungry and we still haven't had literally anything. But the good thing is we haven't spent also any money. And by the way guys, you will also see my boyfriend Ben in this video, but he wasn't as brave and he didn't take part of this challenge, he was just there for the free food. And we got it! And by the way, the staff was super aware of this award and they didn't make you feel uncomfortable at all. Ooh, this was a big bite! I mean, it's free donut, you cannot get wrong. And this challenge was extra hard for me because usually I have like four coffees a day and now I couldn't afford literally any. But thanks God, Greg's was there for me. And of course, I immediately downloaded their app when I heard that I can get a free coffee. I mean, I got an espresso, so it wasn't like the most worth it thing, but I really need it because I'm a coffee addict. This is a bit hot. It is, but I really need it. One hour later. Drum roll! I think I found what we can have for lunch. I found like a coupon that can work for us. Basically, it is this free pasta kit. The only bummer here is that you have to actually print it and we'll go to the print store. Fingers crossed that it costs like 50p, I would say, not more because otherwise it might be out of our budget, but hopefully it will work. So I went to this place called Snappy Snaps to print the coupon. Guess how much they told me I should pay for one page printed team, black and white, two pounds. Like, are, are they insane? They're totally out of their mind. This was a little bit unexpected because I thought that I have my lunch sorted, but I guess it wasn't that easy. So plan B, eating free food, was in action. One of the things which we didn't discuss is that, you guys, we don't have enough budget even to take the bus or the metro. This is why we'll be literally walking to every single place that you see in this video, but at least we get to see these views. A little update for me. Basically, guys, like in terms of money, I think we're doing great so far because I have literally spent zero. But in terms of hunger, 
not so well. And I have had only donut and a coffee so far. For lunch, we are getting a free taco from Taco Bell because if you download their app, like subscribe to literally every single thing that it says on the app, you get a free taco. I kind of hope that you can also make it veggie because if not, we'll have a little bit of a problem. And we're in front of Taco Bell. Fun fact, this is actually the first time I'll be trying Taco Bell, so I'm kind of curious to see what it's all the fuss about. I mean, there isn't really any particular fuss about Taco Bell at the moment. I just know that it's famous and I have never had it. Come on, And good news, I was able to get the one with beans. Mm. Mm -hmm. How is it? Yeah. This was great, but let's be honest, this wasn't really lunch. So now we'll go to KFC and get a free side and uh, let's see how hungry do I feel after that and I think later we'll have to head off to the supermarket and see what can we get with one pound can I say something I think for like 129 was a fair price uh, I mean like I mean like it's I know it's free but like the actual price is 129 so I didn't know Taco Bell was so cheap we're pretty much a hundred meters from Taco Bell and we're already in front of KFC and I'm thinking what can I get either the mash or a corn Maybe the mash, because it sounds like there will be more food in there. What's that sad face? Oh well, that's cool. The one pound challenge is more turning into starving to death challenge. And uh, to be honest with you, like, I was expecting this to go way better, but it's like almost 3 p.m. and I haven't had like pretty much any food and yeah and I'm starving so I hope we find the KFC sooner now we're just like going from one KFC to the other which I swear I never thought I would do in my life but yeah this is what we're doing at the moment because we're trying to get just like some free mashed potatoes <laughs> life is funny isn't it We are on Leicester Square at the moment and uh, we are about to go to KFC but literally keep your fingers crossed for me that we can get like the free side from there. I think at the moment I have burned more calories while walking than like actually having the food. <laughs> so excited. Hi, what did you get? I got the small popcorn chicken. Better than Taco Bell. I love it. Better. To be honest with you, like I'm quite happy because now they like you could choose from many sides and before I knew you could only get chicken wings and uh, the only small disappointment is that they don't have the mash and this is why I got corn but it's fine. I'm starving like I would eat literally eat anything at the moment. But isn't this like so cute? This is the corn. I cannot wait to have it. I remember there was a lot of butter. Mm. I don't think now there is some. Oh, it's very hot. I like how I'm almost in pain, but still waiting. So far, we have just been getting one snack after the other, and by the time you eat it, you're hungry again. So, yeah, we definitely need something more. Someone's really hungry. Mm, I am. You like it? And it's one of the. Can you, can you rotate it so it's more? Ooh, okay. But it's almost finished. Oh, well. Yeah. What's the actual price of this? I have we no don't idea. Know. We, don't, we don't spend. All right. See you later. A weird feeling that I'm getting. It's like seeing people what they're eating. Like you're having a burrito, a salad, or a pizza. I'm like, no, I cannot have that. No, no. 
of this. No, this is too expensive. So it creates like very weird relationship between me that I'm hungry and I have only one pound and like literally everyone else that it's eating. But it's okay. I have to be honest with you, this challenge is harder than what I expected. Yes, I'm hungry again. <laughs> Let's go to the supermarket. Keep talking, this is such an amazing shot. No one told you to come in the shop. Stay where you are. So far, 11 kilometers just in search of some free food. Calories burned, 5,000. Calories acquired, 500. Much less. Let's go. And we are about to go to St. Bruce, which I really hope is going to be my safe space where I can find like food and we have all the one pound left so we should like have a really huge and uh, filling meal because I'm so hungry, I'm so so hungry so keep your fingers crossed for me that I find something on a really really good offer I think I just found out dinner basically we can get one or two potatoes and uh, this with some sauce, I think this will be our winner for dinner. Chickpeas, 45. 63. And now the secret item that we don't know how much it costs. Look at Oh, but I can only pay by card. Oh, that's a bummer. I honestly don't think I have ever been as excited for a meal in my life. First normal meal that I'm having through the day, which is not fast food or it's like more kind of complete. And it actually costed less than ATP. And uh, the potatoes are quite a lot as well. And my next challenge was to see what can I get with the remaining 20p, which at this point seemed like a lot of money. Until I actually went into the supermarket and I realized that I cannot even get an apple. I think we have a winner here, but it's quite surprising how there isn't like pretty much anything which costs 20p. And this is how I finished my one pound challenge a day in London. I have to say at some point it was a total failure, but overall I think it was pretty much a success. What do you guys think? And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe bell button down below so you don't miss on more cool content. Love you all! Bye!